Hello everybody, it's Mrs. Holman here and I would like to welcome you to today's assembly. This week we celebrate Mental Health Awareness Week and the specific theme this week that is celebrated is kindness. So I thought it apt to start with this beautiful quote. Where there is kindness, there is goodness and where there is goodness, there is magic. So I'd like to invite all of you to bring a little bit more magic into your lives this week. The Mental Health Foundation has conducted a new survey into kindness and found almost two thirds of us say that when people are kind to us, it makes us feel really good about ourselves. The results also found that almost two thirds of people that are kind to others feel good because they have been kind and they can see the positive effects it has. Almost three quarters of us also say it's important that we learn from this coronavirus pandemic that kindness can actually make a difference in our society, helping others and showing empathy. 48% of people surveyed also said being kind to ourselves has a positive impact on our own mental well-being. So there's no doubt about it that it makes us feel good and it makes others feel good. So what are the other benefits of kindness? It can significantly improve our physical and emotional well-being, whether it's giving or receiving. It's also been proven that acts of kindness can improve our immune system, it reduces our stress, it gives us energy, and it's good for our hearts. So the power of being kind goes even further. It has been proven to slow down the aging process, improve our relationships, and it is contagious. Good for our hearts, yes, it changes the chemicals in our body. Committing acts of kindness produces a chemical called oxytocin. Oxytocin causes the release of a chemical called nitric oxide, which then opens up our blood vessels, lowers our blood pressure. And all of this is very good to keep our hearts healthy, specifically extra helpful when we're feeling anxious, nervous or shy. It's contagious. Yes, it spreads pretty quickly. Positive effects of kindness are experienced in the brains of everybody. So whether we're giving, whether we're receiving, or whether we are observing kindness, it makes us feel significantly better. So it creates a ripple effect that can improve the day of loads of people. So again, I want to remind you, it slows down the aging process, it reduces our stress and anxiety, and it makes us feel happy and it makes us feel healthier. So I'd like to just end this assembly to say to you, be kind and see how that makes you feel today. See how that makes you feel this week and also every day for the rest of your lives. Thank you very much for listening to today's assembly. And I really hope that you can apply kindness, not only this week, but every day of your life. Take care, stay safe and stay kind. Goodbye.